We're going to have a look at the word solution to question 3D from checkpoint 2. You were given the parallelogram ABCD, and in question D you were asked to determine the equation of the line that is perpendicular to AB and it passes through point A. So there is a new line on the graph that's not shown, and it passes through A and it is perpendicular to AB. Now, in question A, you were given the equation of AB as 3x minus 2y is equal to 4. So if we rearrange that into standard form, and now divide through by 2, you get y to be 3 over 2x minus 2. So that means that the gradient of AB is equal to 3 over 2. Now, because the lines are perpendicular, we know that the gradient of the perpendicular line multiplied by the gradient of AB will be negative 1. So that means the gradient of the perpendicular has to be negative because only a positive times a negative will give you a negative, and it needs to be the reciprocal fraction. So it will be negative 2 over 3. So that means that my new equation will be in the form of y minus y1 equals m x minus x1. We can substitute in the coordinates of a, which are 6 and 7. So that gives us y minus 7 is equal to negative 2 thirds, x minus 6, and if we simplify negative 2 thirds times x is negative 2 thirds x, negative 2 thirds times negative 6 is positive 4, because 3 goes into 6 twice, and 2 times 2 is 4, and that means if we then add 7 to both sides, you get negative 2 thirds x, and 7 add 4 is positive 11. So the equation of the perpendicular to AB is negative 2 thirds x plus 11.